What's going on guys, Moran here, and over the last few years I've gotten lean many, many times. But during these times I didn't always feel good on the inside. So very often I looked great to the outside, but I didn't actually feel good. And sometimes that has to do with sacrifice. You cannot expect to do a men's physique competition and not be suffering at all. But if you just want to get down to 10% body fat or 8% body fat and shine on the beach, your life does not have to be miserable, okay? And right now I run multiple companies. I live a very productive lifestyle. I want to feel my best, perform my best, but also still be lean, right? And it is possible, but you have to make certain changes and adaptations to your diet. So in the last few months, I've really been optimizing my diet for ultimate performance. And today I'm gonna to show you this. So a part of my morning routine is once I wake up, I have a glass, pink Himalayan salt, and lemon. So we're gonna fill up the glass with warm water. It does not have to be boiled. Okay, so we add in the lemon, we just squeeze it. And then we add one fourth of a tablespoon of Himalayan salt. I've done this many times, so I just estimate it. Okay, in the morning you're very dehydrated guys because your body did not get any water during the night. This is the reason why a lot of people don't feel energized because they forget about this part. And just drinking water is great, but this is even better. So next to this glass, I'll have another glass about a liter within the first half of hour of waking. So I have this vitamin C in the lemon, then we also have magnesium and potassium uh, in the Himalayan pink salt, as well as electrolytes and a lot of minerals, over 80, okay? So this is the ultimate drink. I, it's pretty doable, I just do it in once or twice. You can just taste the freshness. Starting off my day today, working at home for a few hours, and then I'm gonna have my first meal because I still do intermittent fasting, which I'll explain in a second having some black coffee and water. I like to limit my caffeine intake to maximum three or four cups a day. And I like to take a supplement, a nootropic called L-theanine. So the combo of L-theanine with caffeine makes you very focused, very productive, but it takes away some of the side effects from caffeine like jitteriness or anxiety. So this is a great formula for focus, especially if you combine it with intermittent fasting. Now, one problem I've experienced with intermittent fasting is that as soon as I would break my fast and have my first meal, I would feel sluggish. I would, you know, get this crazy blood sugar rush, uh, ups and downs, and I wouldn't be able to really focus anymore. The way I used to focus, uh, like during my fast in the morning. So my work would kind of like suffer in the afternoon. But I've tried something out lately, and that is to not eat any carbs at my first meal. And that was sort of like the problem. I would eat carbs, raise my blood sugar levels, and I would feel sluggish and also a lot of calories. And now I'm able to have less calories, but a more filling meal. So I will still be filled up after fasting because you need a good amount of food after you break your fast. If you break it with a small amount of food, that's not good, then you're gonna binge later. But I've basically pushed my carbs to later on the day, okay? So what I'm having here is three whole eggs, then I have some turkey bacon. So both of this, the eggs, turkey bacon, I have a lot of protein, um, also healthy fats. And the turkey bacon has a lot less fat than you know regular bacon, it's much leaner. And some avocado, 50 grams. And avocado is great for your skin, also for your brain health, has many benefits. I don't use any salt, by the way, because it's already on the turkey bacon. So I just like to add some pepper to this meal. And these are the three supplements that I take with my first meal. And there I was just telling you guys that I cut down on caffeine. Oops. Just put up at the office and it's a beautiful day today. Sun is shining, blue skies, let's freaking go. Now our office is getting more and more complete and look at this, I'm so excited to finally have our My Shredded Lifestyle logo on the wall. It's one and a half meters, it's massive, it's freaking sick. I love it guys and we have to celebrate that, okay? With a massive sale. And no, it's actually coincidence. We're not celebrating the logo, but we do have a garage sale at My Shredded Lifestyle and there will be massive discounts, okay? Uh, the biggest ones next to Black Friday, which we only do once a year, but that is in November. Today, there will be 70% off all our fitness gear, eBooks, everything on our website, okay? Literally everything, 70% off. Tomorrow, there will be 60% off, and then the day after that, there will be 50% off. So it's a garage sale, three days, but you guys realize that it is Monday today, and the day is almost over within a few hours. So you can now still grab that 70% discount so maybe you want a massage gun maybe you want to give this a try okay i use this pretty much every freaking day to loosen my muscles or you want to use straps for back training or maybe you want to take your bench press to the next level with our wrist wraps 
or take your squad to the next level with our knee sleeves, okay? And keep you protected. There's just so much we have. Such a big discount. It's surely gonna sell out, okay? So be there on time. And um, yeah, I cannot wait for you guys to enjoy all the fitness gear, our eBooks and everything else. So it's myshreddedlifestyle.com. The link will be in the description box of this video. Now, one thing I like to have in between my meals, so what I've been doing lately, is have a fermented drink. So this is kombucha. I'm not sponsored by this company. I actually think this particular one is pretty freaking overpriced. Um, but so kombucha is a fermented drink. Now you can also get these health benefits, uh, like you know, benefits for your digestive system, uh, your gut health. There's like, there's like living bacteria in this, right? Uh, like little microbes. It's pretty weird. And when you think about it, it sort of tastes like that. You know, it's, it's hard to describe this taste. It's it's like a in between, sort of like a rosé wine with some alcohol, but then also sort of like apple cider vinegar, which is which is horrible, but it's. This is a combination. I've learned to sort of like it. You can also get these health benefits from actual foods, but that is like fermented, you know, like pickles, sauerkraut is foods that I don't necessarily like. Content seen by the right people, like you said, not just followers, but followers that will convert into sales. Yeah. So it sort of depends what your unique factor is, which platform you want to use. So this is the meal that I cooked this morning. Now guys, I'm not gonna try and act to be the perfect fitness influencer. So yes, I do cook plenty of my food, but I also uh, don't, you know, at some months more than others, I uh, do a lot of takeaway or I order stuff, uh, which is usually still healthy food, but it's like prep meals and things of that nature. So anyway, today I did prep my own food and what we got is sweet potatoes. So we do have some carbs, but it's, it's 200 grams, so it's not that much. Then we have beef meatballs, 150 grams. Now these were already pre-cooked, okay? So this is very simple. Now we have broccoli, purple cabbage, and pumpkin. And pumpkin is really nice together with sweet potato as well. So I'm a simple man. This is a great meal, but it was easy to make and quick. <laughs> So anyway, as far as intermittent fasting, like why do I love it so much, okay? There are basically four reasons why. And I've been doing this now for, I'd say like at least six years straight every freaking day, okay? There's been exceptions because I don't have to do it. So when I'm on vacation and there's a nice breakfast buffet at a hotel, I will freaking get it, okay? But um, just in my regular life, I will definitely be fasting in the morning because I just love it so much. So reason number one has to do with what I already talked about and that is focus okay the focus it gives me in the morning the mental clarity is something that is truly exceptional and what intermittent fasting will provide you with and many entrepreneurs don't even you know try to lose a lot of weight or get super shredded but use intermittent fasting as a strategy to be able to focus better mentally now reason number two is that it saves time and it literally does in two different ways it saves time by actually prepping the food because imagine like prepping just three big meals or maybe four compared to prepping six or eight smaller meals during the day you know that's a lot of work to prep that food okay now professional bodybuilders do this and it's it's logical because it's their job but if you want to do something else with your life next to just lifting uh, you're an entrepreneur you want you know to do some something else as a career then it's not very realistic to be able to spend all that time okay now the time spent eating is also much more if you eat six or eight meals a day compared to eating three big meals okay because it always draws you out of a certain focus that you have so i cannot work very productively if i have to eat six meals during the day and i've, I've done this many times over the years but it was never my most productive time you know during the year it always was when i did intermittent fasting and then i could also enjoy my meals more because i didn't have to rush and i could just take my time to eat those big meals right and number three is dealing with hunger and dealing with cravings and some people when they start fasting they think that you know this is not for me i'm going to be very hungry because not eating will make me hungry and that sounds very logical but if you do fasting correctly your body will actually know that you're gonna have that food later on the day so your body gets used to that rhythm okay and what if you drink enough water and you do everything right during the fasting period that hunger will literally go away now if i have to eat like for six meals a day i will get very hungry because every meal is not very satisfying it's pretty small so i would just be looking forward towards my next meal i wouldn't really be properly filled up and this is something that i always noticed while dieting and that's why i never really got lean easily before intermittent fasting for real because it would always have that hunger and those cravings and this has to do with reason number four and that's that intermittent fasting allows you to live an enjoyable lifestyle okay because you're able to save all those calories for me for example i fast for 16 hours a day and then i have my eating window in eight hours so i can save a lot of calories for that period and then maybe i want to have dinner with some friends i want to have a barbecue but i'm cutting body fat so i cannot have too many calories but now i saved up the buffer of calories for the day so i can enjoy myself 
and even have some nice treats, you know, that with a normal diet, I would never be able to fit in. So that's the power of fasting. And guys, it's not all simple, okay? But the reason why it's so enjoyable as well is because it is a little bit difficult, okay? So you have to go through this fasting period for, you know, the majority of the day, but then you're able to eat at night and you also feel great because you know that, you know, you've had that mental toughness to make it through the day without eating, even though your body maybe, maybe saw like a bar laying there, your body saw something else, someone else eating. I was like, oh my God, I have this craving, but you did not give in. And then at the end of the evening, you can really indulge in nice food and you can be proud of yourself, you know, and then it really feels like a feast at night. And I, I love that feeling. I think it's amazing. So yeah, those are really some of the main benefits of fasting. There's even more. And now it's time to get back to work. So it's about an hour after my second meal and now it's time to hit the gym. Let's go. Workout of the day is a push workout. It's gonna be a quick workout, about 45 minutes. Starting off with handstands, then you're gonna move on to chest, shoulders, and triceps. Let's go. I got bad thoughts that make my mind scared. Hold me hostage and they don't fight fair. Who gon' pray for me and wipe on my tears? Who gon' save me if you not right here? Move this darkness and make my sight clear. And then I'm off the deep end, apparition. Committing treason all alone Who gon' hear me screaming? Ah! Manifestations of my fears Regrets that stretched out for light years Can almost touch the light, homie, it's right here Sleep trapped in my nightmares Crazy pump guys, it's feeling great. I had a really busy day today, you know, so I'm pretty fried. I was pretty fried when I got here. I was like, it's not gonna be a good workout. We're making it happen anyway. I still came in the gym and I haven't done this machine in quite a while. Cause you know guys, I was like, uh, last few months I was doing a bit of different training, like functional calisthenics. And at some point I sort of like quit bodybuilding a little bit to just do like calisthenics. So I was doing, uh, for chest, I was not doing any isolation lifts anymore, but I was doing like weighted dips and all those calisthenics movements. But honestly, for me, that got a little bit boring, you know? So what I personally like right now is to, to combine some skills, you know, and some calisthenics some functional training and also still bodybuilding, because I, I still love the freaking pump. I want to have those 3D delts as far as you can get those being a natty and just, you know, work on the best possible physique. Like the physique I had when I was up on a stage, but then not as lean, of course. The healthy version of that men's physique look, you know? Small waist. Wide round shoulders and skinny calves. Let's go. Post workout meal, we got a blender shake with unsweetened almond milk, spinach, frozen fruits, oats, and whey protein, cookies and cream flavor. We're just gonna blend this up, and this is a really nice way to get healthy nutrients in within literally a few minutes. And for dinner, cooking up something fairly simple here as well. We got some potatoes, which we're gonna cut in parts, put it in the air fryer, because then it only takes about 12 minutes. So I love the air fryer, but you can also do it in the oven, it takes about 30 to 35 minutes. Then, in the meantime, we're gonna cut the vegetables. We got onion, zucchini, and green beans. We're gonna start with frying the onion and the zucchini, and in another pan, we're gonna fry the chicken filet. We're gonna fry the chicken for about one and a half minutes on each side, so three minutes in total. Then we're gonna add some light cooking cream and green pesto. And now we're gonna put the fire on low and let it cook for about five to six minutes. So really make the chicken absorb the sauce. It will cook in the sauce and it will be freaking Juicy. Look, we have a visitor. Okay. She's very shy. But cute. Oh, I think she's scared of it. She's scared of the camera. Yeah. Bobo Pocha? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Cute. The final meal of the day, and I have some blueberries here with a scare, white chocolate, and strawberry. 
I like to have some different flavors of this. And when I get really low in calories, I'll just have like the natural scare version or the, the natural quark. But for now, I can have the one with a little bit of added sugar because they, they do taste better, you know, that's the reality. So total calories of the day, 2,600. These are the macros. This is what I'm currently eating at the moment. And guys, giveaway of today is gonna to be really cool because you're gonna be able to win a one-on-one -on -one VIP call with me, okay, completely free. The only thing you have to do to enter this giveaway is go to the description box down below, click on the link to moran.club, my website, uh, then you can enter the giveaway there and you'll see what to do. You just have to follow me on YouTube, that's it. Okay, and then I'll pick one of you and you can have a chat with me for 30 minutes about anything, about business, about life, about fitness, any questions you have, or just a casual chat with me, okay? Anything. It's going to be cool. I'm excited to talk to one of you guys soon. So I entered that giveaway and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the full day of eating. Let me know if I should do more, any other video ideas. And if you enjoyed the series, man, please let me know in the comments because I appreciate the comments, you know. Views have been a bit lower. I need to get back on the grind. You know, I've been going for a while, so that's to be expected. I'm accepting it and I keep the grind going. So if you guys want to show me some support, that would always be great uh, because I appreciate it. And that's what I do for the, to read those comments, get that interaction with you guys. I love it, man. So I'm happy to be back uh, here on YouTube. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Gotta keep pushing through. Yeah, I keep doing my own thing. Yeah, never looking back. Again, I can get it, I can make it, yeah, I know it, and I'm never looking back.